So this question starts off by giving us this equation here. Um, it goes on to say the given equation represents a volume X in gallons of a 10% salt water solution. So that's, that's that. That will be mixed with a volume Y in gallons of a 20% salt water solution. So that must be that there. Um, to produce an 18% salt water solution. Okay, so that makes sense. And then it says what volume in gallons of the 20% salt water solution will be needed. Okay, so basically what is the Y value? Because Y is the, is the gallons of the 20% salt water solution. So how much Y will be needed if 50 gallons of the 10% salt water solution is used? So what is Y equal when X is equal to 50? So I'm going to simplify this equation by replacing X with 50 and solving for Y. So when I get rid of that X there and put 50, 0 0.10 times 50 is 5. So I'd still have 0 0.20Y here equals, if I replace this with 50, 0.18 times 50 is 9. And then, of course, 0.18 times Y is 0.18Y. I can now start to simplify and combine like terms. I want my Ys on the left-hand side. So if I subtract 0.18Y from both sides here, I'm running out of space. So that's gone there. And on the left-hand side, I'd still have, in fact, let's just do all the math right now. If I subtract five from both sides, and five is gone on that side. So on the left-hand side, all I would have is 0.02y equals nine minus five, which is four. I'd then divide both sides by 0.02. Go to my calculator just to make sure I'm doing my math correctly. And we say 4 divided by 0 0.02 is equal to 200. And therefore, y equals 200. And therefore, the answer to our question is 200. So at the end of the day, this question really was about plug in information from the question, right? Because the question gave you the equation. And the question told you x was equal to 50, right? So we just plugged it in and solved for why.